Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Ricky Tiki TV. Today we got another video coming for you and we'll get straight to it. It's the power attenuator from Harley Benton. And the reason I want to show you guys is because if you have a 100 watt, 50 watt tube head with a 4x12, you know, like me, JCM 900 cab because it's, you know, it's coronavirus season, I guess, and <laughs> You go to your band room and you go get all your stuff and now it's sitting in your house and you're like, hey man, you know, I actually would like to uh, play this sweet, you know, Marshall head, tube head, and but it's way too loud, you know, and to get tube break up on a 100 watt JCM 900 head, which is overkill already, you know, <laughs> it's going to be real loud. It's going to start, you know, shattering some windows back here. So, this is what you need. The Harley Benton power attenuator. Well, really any power attenuator. Um, but for me, I like to keep things pretty cheap. Uh, I don't have a lot of money. That's why I don't make a lot of videos. I don't have products coming at my door every day. You know, everything I get, I have to pay for it. So when I come across something that's useful, I'm like, hey, let me put this on the channel. So, you know, anybody else out there that has, you know, a similar question or a similar problem, Maybe this will be a solution. So if that's interesting to you, then please go ahead and subscribe. Um, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to the video. All right, guys. So some of you are probably wondering, what the heck is a power attenuator and how do I use it? And which power attenuator is right for me? There's a bunch of choices on the internet, ranging from very high prices to low prices and to put it in a nutshell, it really comes down to features and what you want to use it for. So I'm going to tell you what I use it for. I use a power attenuator um, because right now during the COVID-19 crisis, you know, I'm not going to be doing any live shows for a long time probably. I would say until 2021, if I'm guessing. And so I wanted to have my amplifier in my room and I do like it. I want to play it. You know, I want to hear it. You know, it's it's you know, it's a nice amplifier, so you want to you want to play with it, you know? So how do you do that? Well, a 100 watt tube head is freaking loud. <laughs> I mean, this amplifier is super loud. I mean, you don't even have to go up that high and you'll be, you know, rocking the windows. So for that application, if all you want to do is be able to play your amp at a reasonable bedroom level, okay, and still get that nice tone that you usually get when it's cranked way loud, uh, then this will be perfect for you. The Harley Benton Power Attenuator. Now, if you have a 100 watt head, you want to make sure you have the power attenuator that can handle 100 watts. And that's what this one is. And it's really simple, guys. I'm not going to sit here and talk about it a lot, but it's under $100. I don't remember exactly how much. I think I paid like 60 or something. Uh, it's under 100 though, 100% positive. And it allows you to have great tone at a low volume level. And how this works is it sits between the amp head and the cabinet. And with this little knob here on the right, if you turn it down, that means the speaker volume in your cab goes down. The volume goes down. If you turn the the knob here on the right up clockwise, then the volume in the speaker cabinet goes up. Um, this thing does not require any power, so you don't have to plug it into the wall or anything. It sits literally between the amp head and the cabinet, and that's it. I have not uh, got this thing close to being you know overworked I have not even heard the fans come on this light that says full power there this little LED light has not even came on yet I've had this amp cranked up around three o'clock and <laughs> you know three o'clock to me uh, let's see channel a here three o'clock would be like where it is now on channel a that's loud that is really loud <laughs> but I have the volume set here and it's not that loud 
Just remember guys, you're going to need speaker cables, a speaker cable from your amp head into the power attenuator and then another speaker, uh, speaker cable from the power attenuator into the cabinet and then you're good to go. And you know, actually this thing would be useful for band situations too. I mean, sometimes you don't need to be that loud. Um, the sound guys will love you for it when you're playing live. Trust me, I know. <laughs> I have not used this live, but I know sound guys. And when you bring this in, they're like, oh, hell, here we go again. So <laughs> they'll love you for it. So this is a really great buy. Uh, in the description box below, I'll leave a URL link so you can check this out. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. And if you have a power attenuator, maybe you can help um, some of the other guys watching this video on how you use it. I use it for this. That's it. Reducing volume. That's all I use it for. Um, one other thing I want to mention, because when I first got this thing, I was like concerned because <laughs> when I up this volume, you hear that? Well, that's perfectly normal. I thought it was broke. I didn't want to, like, I wrote Tobin. I was like, hey, man, what's up with this thing? It's perfectly normal. So uh, don't worry about it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, there's no sound clips because you really don't need it. I mean, this is not about how my amp sounds. This is about, you know, from a real guitar player, can this handle my 100 watts uh, tube head be without blowing the thing up or something? That's what I was worried about. And it can. And I've done it over and over again because I love my amp and I want to play it. And during the COVID-19, you know, like I said, there's not going to be a lot of shows coming up for a while. So a lot of you guys are going to want to play at home with your nice amps, whether that, you know, your dual rectifiers or whatever have you. Um, if you just need a simple thing to reduce the volume but still keep your tone, this is perfect. This thing is freaking, this thing is sturdy, man. This thing is really sturdy and a good price. So thanks for watching. I'll let you guys get out of here. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace.